Hello everyone, this is Hunter. Today I'm going to talk about uh, improved display. So this type of object is most common used in our PR studio. If we want to read or write some value, we need to use this object to realize the function. So following, let me in quick introduce how we set it in the software. So we can find the improved display on the common object or in this input display list so we can click it to the screen and open the setting firstly we have three type address addresses here read only write only or and read and write so if we set it like this it is read only and if I check the box for the, this input, this is for the read and write. And the last, if I uh, uncheck the box for the same read and write and delete this address from the red one. So this is for the write only. User can set different type address according to their needs. For example, there are several communication address for inverter, just the read-write only type. So we can set it in this way. Please remember to refer your device menu for communication protocol before you want to set the address type. Because once here we set the read and write, but in the menu, it indicates it is read only. At this moment, we will get timeout error in HMI. So we can check the menu in advance to avoid this kind of simple mistake happen. This note is for keyboard remark. When we open the keyboard, this remark word will write into the HUW4002. So here I already set in advance some note. This this is address number one and this is address number two. And here is address number zero. So this is the note words. So let me compile it. And uh, as we can see, if I open this HDW0 and uh, it will write the address number one to, to, to this note, and uh, I click on this HDW1 and uh, it write this to, to this word. And uh, here, here we also can see I can click label one and it write number zero to, to this note. The next one is the continuous input display. So uh, this continuous input means if I set the several objects in the same group, then if I open the keyboard, I need to input to the last one object for this group and it will be able to close automatically. So for will observe, I put some in the uh, uh, as a one clone. So they are all in the group one. And uh, let me back to the offline simulator. So if I open this, and uh, we will see that this continuous in object it is highlight so they ask me to know which address we arrive to now so for example I input one two three four five as we can see it it work like works like this and here is for us to set in the font style and this is for set number of character display as asterisk 
and here is for us to set the alignment to the center align to left or align to the right and this is for the quick read quick read is for us to set the communication priority for this object so if you add this for the this object it will update quicker than any object which is without check the box remember do not check too many quick read for the project because it will easily let other address delay a lot and here is for set the data format this is for opening position for keypad this indirect adjusting we put it on the last to say and uh, the last one is the label if we want to add some mark or unit we can use this function to add so like this one i already add the mainly voltage to this label so we can see that it display like this So this is many function of the nominic one. And another one is the character input. It is mainly used for display some tag name or some username. So other functions are same with nominic, so we skip it name and just set a different setting. So first we can set this read D word. So if I input the AB to this HDW0 and the input CD input to this HDW1 as we can see this D wall is turned out like this it just reads the first character for this address and the next one is the high low byte exchange and the high low word exchange so let me back to the simulator as we can see if we input a b c d in the h t w zero the byte exchange the, its result will be like the b a d c and the word exchange will be like the c d a b so which one we need also we need according to the specific protocol when menu so um, this is our own content about the character one so let's back to the indirect addressing this function is something like address index or address offset its all actual reading value is from another one address so let me take an example so here is the screen I already made so there are some several addresses I already initial the value to them if the original address is the HDW10 and this offset offset value is the uh, HAW0 so if I input the uh, 15 to to this to this offset value as we can see in right now is it is reading the uh, HDW25 value so it is 150 so um, this is the uh, in, indirect address addressing how it works. So thanks for your watching. See you next time.